So now we're ready to attach our super winch uh, to our anchor. We have our 12 volt super winch, 12 volt battery, and our two uh, back anchor points. So to put our anchor together to support the winch and the tower, we're gonna use two three quarter inch shackles and two half inch shackles. And we're gonna build ourselves an anchor. So the first thing we're gonna do is attach our half inch anchors to our back anchor points like so. Same for the other one. Then we're going to take our bigger three quarter inch shackle and bind these two together. And then our final three-quarter shackle we'll use to attach our now uh, our anchor to our actual winch. Next, we're gonna install our handle to the back set of our winch and we'll be ready to raise the tower. So now that our winch is attached to our anchor point, we're gonna go ahead and attach our handle to the bottom of the winch. And the purpose of the handle is mainly to manipulate the winch from one direction to another when we're letting out slack or taking in slack. It's really important that we have a nice even coil like this, so the handle helps us achieve this. So in order to put the handle on the winch, We'll just raise it up and attach it to our lag bolts that are currently attached to the winch. And then secure them with our nuts. Now we can attach our winch handle. So we're finally ready to attach the end of our winch to the end of our gin pole and begin to raise our gin pole and tower. And in order to do that, we'll push our lever here into the neutral mode and we'll pull out slack. So our final gin pull setup, as you can see, we have our lifter wires attached one through four, lowest to highest in order here on our bottom shackle. We wanna make sure that's tight. On the side here, we have our two safety wires to keep the gin pull level in when it's in a vertical motion. And we also have our actual winch anchor point attached to the back side of our rocker plate here, which is what's gonna pull the gin pull up to a vertical position. So before we raise our tower, we're just gonna kind of do a quick walkthrough and make sure that all of our bolts are tight, make sure that our flanges are completely compressed, make sure our guy wires are nice and in order, and just do a quick walkthrough of the tower to make sure everything is secure.